it is 5 in the morning, 5.30. I'm on my way to Chicago, where I will meet up with Xander and John, and we will head to Peoria, Illinois. I did not go last year. It should be a lot of fun for this Pokemon original. Um, I need to stop doing 6 a.m. flights. I'm very tired. We have been delayed an hour for mechanical issues. We got delayed again, and then our delay got canceled, and now we're good to go. I think I'm on my way to Chicago. Fingers crossed, it's still seven in the morning. I really want to sleep. Just wanted to get on this plane and knock out. It was a secondary maintenance issue and we were deplaned. I uh, don't know if I am going to be taking off anytime soon. Hopefully this vlog actually gets to happen because it looks pretty unlikely at this point. I'm gonna go talk to someone and try to get off the next possible flight out of here. After uh, getting deplaned, getting back on the plane, a uh, lot of chaotic stuff. I have landed in Chicago three hours later than I originally intended. intended. Uh, and now I'm heading to go meet up with Xander and John, and we're gonna drive three hours to Peoria. I fell asleep in the car as Alex yoked for an hour, and I woke up and we're here. And um, I like died, like I full on died in the car for an hour. So um, we're here. I want to go check out my hotel, and then time to play Pokemon. Oh, look, the TV has my name on it. That's hype. Um, pretty nice hotel. I'm chilling here. Marriott. I'm gonna go check in now. Get my swag. I heard that the promo is Kita. So, not really looking forward to that. I woke up from my slumber to hear that. So, yeah, it's cold outside. I'm very chilly. Yay, we're here, Peoria. Welcome to America. <laughs> well, we're at Goof and Boo's birthday dinner. We've got the gang, Cody's here, Lock's here. Can we say hi? It's a vlog. A vlog? Hello, vlog. Uh, birthday dinner angle. It's game day. I got back from dinner last night, tested with the guys a little bit longer, and Chien Pao was testing the best. The whole group was going with it, so I, you know, I didn't really want to be against the grain. So I'm gonna play Chan Pao today with Baxialver. We're gonna see how that goes. Should be exciting. Um, I mean, it's like Lugia, but a little more high roll, I guess. Matchup spread seems really good. We're gonna see what happens. I'm definitely unfamiliar with the deck, but I agreed to play the best deck possible at every event to try and win, so yeah. Picked up the first one against Trenton. Awesome opponent, a lot of fun to play against him. Helped me with some Chien Pao tips. It was a good time. Four and O heading into lunch break. Chien Pao, baby. I'm playing casino today. This is crazy. Put me on the slot machine. I hate gambling. I am gambling averse. We've got professional commentator, caster, and cutie, Kyle Sablehouse. How are you doing today, buddy? I am doing stuff. Record. 2 one, one. Okay. Mr. Sablehouse, Ryan. How are you doing today? What's up? Record. 3-1. Three, one. Let's see your first Three, one. I thought you wanted to know how I was feeling and stuff. No. Two path decks I've lost twice. Path is really hard to deal with for Chan Pao. Hit Judge Path Mew, really tough. And then I hit um, Rhydon, which also did not feel super great. I whiffed. In game one, I had like a terrible start, so I was really far down. Game two, I had a chance. I mean, I, I should have I should have like gotten the knockout or where I needed to, but I like completely whiffed. And then from there, I was down like three prizes and the game just like snowballed out of control. So that really sucked. Like I could have traded, but yeah, it happens. I am 61. I made it into day two with Chan Pao. I had a really unpleasant round nine. Uh, I'll talk about it more in my tournament report, but I played it out. I played it out at 6-2, tried to get a match, more match wins for today, but we tied naturally. So 6-2-1 with Chan Pao. I am six rounds tomorrow. I gotta go 5-1. We'll see what happens. High roll a little bit. We'll see, we'll see. Rise and grind, baby. Day two, by the time we're going in. Gotta make sure hour, because the West, not West Coast, <laughs> Mall, Central Time buff, but I'm gonna go drop off my suitcase and then get to the venue and play. I made this custom shirt in Shibuya, so I forgot that I had this in here, so I'm gonna wear it for good luck. The atmosphere of day two is electric. I am 101 on the day. Tied in you the max judge path deck. I'll take it, bad matchup. We're here, we're vibing. Day two is going crazy. Sims over there, somewhere. Judge has, and me. Top 32, probably locked in. I hit my good buddy Gibby, my local. Played it out, I got there. Didn't lose again today, 4-2, but you know, it happens. 
Heading home. This guy's just on my flight now. Yeah. I'm home from Peoria, Illinois. It was an awesome event. I had a lot of fun. I met a lot of amazing people. You guys are crazy awesome. Uh, very lucky to have the fans and the, and the people who watch this channel that I do. You guys are super, super awesome. That being said, there is nothing in Peoria, Illinois for food. That was really tragic. Um, but overall, it was a lot of fun. I played Chan Pao, had a good time. Tournament report's already up. You know how I be, I'm cooking. But uh, next step, Sacramento. I, I really want to get a dub one of these days. I really want to do really well, but I, I can't really be upset with how my season has started. Like, a top eight and a top 32 back-to-back -back is pretty insane. But uh, we want to keep the momentum up. I want to continue this hot streak that I'm on, and I want to continue playing well. That's the one thing I want to do. So thank you guys for everything. You guys are the MVPs, and I hope you guys are enjoying coming along my journey, because this is all to make um, an experience, a story. Um, see the kind of things I go through on a day-to-day -day basis. So thank you guys, and I um, appreciate it. My favorite event food is the concession hot dogs. I don't know why, but they hit different.